Hello, this is Host Gigabytes, and today I'm going to sh show that how to install Windows ME on VMware Workstation 12 Player. So, click on the new work, create new virtual machine, and here select your ISO file from the folder you did, you have saved there. So. Uh, yeah got it click next then name your virtual machine so I'm going to name it Windows ME test uh, if you want if you desire to change the location you can click browse and save save on your desired location So click next. Then uh, maximum maximum disk size you should select up to 10 GB. So then split and split virtual disk into multiple files. Then click next. Because uh, here you have to change the RAM amount. So click uh, customize hardware. Then click up to 512 MB then click close or if you want to change anything else you can click there also then click close finish so now that started started automatically see I so click here click inside the area and then it's sorry Wait a minute. Uh, restart. Yeah. So boot from CD DVD. Okay. Enter. Start window setup from CD DVD. Enter. So it says welcome. Uh, then click enter. Configure unallocated, unallocated space. Enter. Enable large support. Enter. Enter. Is, I think there is something wrong. So power restart. CD room. CD room. It says it's formatting drive C. It's 100%. Press enter. So that's the main setup. It says here that's 30 to 60 minutes, but we are going to finish it earlier. So click next. So click on C Windows recommended. Click next. Now it says 38 minutes. That's faster. So it takes a little bit time. So do, do not hurry. So we are uh, use, not using typical, but uh, in portable, yeah. Po no, sir. Okay, portable. Uh, 
install most common components recommended click text if you want to change your computer name just press backspace key and enter your computer name so i'm going to enter here mvr win okay uh, it's not uh, necessary to fill the computer description so click next click your country or region so i'm going to select india India click next select your time re time zone so yeah it's here Calcutta Chennai yeah click finish so now will take some time so you can just rest behind and or do something else hello so here it sees connects you to the web so I please note that uh, if you want to use the net on uh, windows millennium so you need to install some another sort of uh, drivers which are not included with the operating system you use the net so i'm just uh, giving you a such note because uh, if you ha have any problems so you can just get uh, stuck there so uh, it's uh, pretty much pretty much faster it's only says uh, 22 minutes and it's 56 progress 56 percent so i think uh, it should be done a bit within uh, 20 or 15 minutes so let's see so now it's uh, only ha we have uh, some uh, three or four percent of uh, file uh, to be copied then it's restarting so click restart now here So see so now I think uh, it wouldn't show the as it wouldn't ask to from boot from hard disk or CD yeah so now it says uh, 18 minutes no it's 10 sorry And I want to I want to say something that uh, if you want to connect a, a new device such as a, a scanner or printer something so, sort of new that's not recently launched so you have to still uh, install new drivers and uh, another sort of things to work on it so be careful and uh, don't <laughs> blame anyone else that you have not tell so I'm just saying that as a precautionary warning and uh, I will also tell you the product key of your uh, of this uh, version so you have not you do not have to struggle to find it anywhere else so it would be included in my description there would would be a link to Google Drive so you can access there So it's 10 minutes. So setting up hardware. I think don't. Oh, it's done. So 